Hello my wonderful friends, Megas with you on a beautiful day in Asha. I am so excited about today's message. If you're brand new to the channel, we're Zoroastrians, we are the Magi. And we're going to be reading out of what, what is the Zoroastrian Bible. It's our prophet Zoroaster's actual words. And there's 17 songs and we're in song 3 today. And this song, this chapter, is to remove suffering from your life and to be happy. So I think you came on a good day if you're brand new to this channel. In verse 1 it says, Now I shall speak of the two principles. And this is really what sets us apart from all the other religions. Ours is the original that the others branched off of. They used a lot of our stories. But, but they changed two principles. In our religion we have an all good God and then an evil spirit. And they're, they're not alike at all. You'll see in the religions that branched off from ours, their God can send good and evil. He can be at peace and war. He can love and hate. My, my friends, in ours, it's two separate principles. God, good, cannot do bad. And the evil spirit, bad, cannot do good. So there's no confusion right there. It's so beautiful. It sets so many people free. Just that idea, that truth. My friends, they think, oh, that resonates what's in my heart. That, that God is just good. My friends, it's beautiful. Then, then listen to this. It says in verse 2, Each man and woman for his or herself select either of the two. You've got to choose one. It says, awaken to this doctrine of ours. The two mentalities, the two minds, the two spirits, the two principles. That's the foundation of our religion. We're getting to the good part, my friends, to end all suffering and to live happy. It's possible. It says, between these two, the seekers of false gods did not decide correctly because delusion came to them in their deliberations. Therefore, they cho chose the worst mind, the bad, the evil. And get this. This is about resonance. This is about seed time and harvest. It says, To them rushed wrath, affliction, and suffering. My, my friends, th there's no way around it. If you choose God good, you choose love and peace and kindness, you're planting an energetic seed and there shall be a harvest and you're going to receive love. You're in resonance for it. You're going to receive peace, if friendship. Now people that chose the worst mind, they're now in resonance for those consequences. Suffering, pain, we can remove that by separating or getting rid of an idea uh, of a God that's mixed. Zoroaster means unmixed, undefiled, unpolluted, undiluted, just pure, pure light, pure love. Does, doesn't get angry, doesn't hate, doesn't kill men, women, and children, just good. Listen to this. I love this. this now we're talking about the Magi. And may we, the Magi, be the ones who make life fresh and bring happiness through holding Asha. Okay, what is Asha? Asha, it's the perfect creator's perfect idea of you and this world and, and living in that attunement to, to the God mind, to, to that, that good principle. But by holding that, the perfect creator's perfect mind had a perfect idea. We be that. We don't be angry, hate, war, kill. We be the love we want to see in the world. It's that resonance again. We be that peace. We be that good. And it brings happiness. And it sets us free from the suffering that is planted when we hold hate. When we hold anger. When we hold jealousy. When we hold the false gods. The false word. Then it says, Then indeed the power of evil and the lie shall be shattered. Those who walk in the good spirit shall immediately be united in the good abode of the good mind. It's Asha, it's heaven on earth. 
immediately. When you're pure and your intentions are pure and you hold that all good spirit, not one of those mixed gods, you restore God's name, his energy, his his identity, his frequency, and we match ourselves, attune ourselves to that, immediately you end the suffering. And you live in a joy and a bliss and happiness. My friends, so beautiful. That's song three of Zarathustra's Gothas. All right, guys, I love you so much. Uh, grab your book, Asha. Read Asha 13 today. It goes perfectly with that. If you don't have Asha... All the money we get from book sales goes to charity. We got two new reviews. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The more reviews we get on Amazon, the more books we sell, the more money we give to charity. And we get this beautiful message to the world. I love, love, love you.